Hi, I'm Kim Wilson, co-founder of Good King. If you are new to Snacking Cacao, welcome to our on-demand tasting of our single serve five pack. I love introducing people to the origins of their snacks. And you're one of the few that has now seen cacao beans, which are used to make chocolate. If you're tasting for the first time, approach this as a tasting flight. Snacking cacao doesn't have the smooth texture or sweetness of chocolate, so prepare yourself for an irresistibly crunchy, almost savory snack, like an almond or a dark chocolate covered espresso bean. Now let's have some fun. Grab the tasting insert found in your pack and we're going to move from top to bottom. We're going to start with a Harmony 65%. Go ahead and pop a couple of beans in your mouth and crunch or chew it like a nut because snacking cacao won't melt ever. Great for summer, not for melting in your mouth. Uh, the caramelized sweet and salty coating on this one mixed with the chocolate reminds me a lot of like a dark chocolate covered caramel corn, except a little bit more sophisticated. It's our simplest product. It has only three ingredients, cacao, cane sugar, and Himalayan pink salt. And it was developed by our partners in Honduras. It's the only one with a unique roasting process. And uh, it has, it's also our sweetest product. It has still only though about half the sugar of a normal dark chocolate. Okay, now we're graduating to our 80% cacao content line. This is where you'll start to notice some nuances in the flavors between cacao from different origins, from our Honduras and our Indonesian origin. And you'll also, you might notice some flavor variation from bean to bean like you would in tasting fresh grapes or berries. Um, we are starting now with our 80% harmony. This is our best selling product and won a Good Food Award in 2018. Yay! Um, in addition to the dark chocolatey flavor that you'll taste from the light caramelizing, you on the coke in the cocoa, you might notice some coffee notes and some almond notes. On occasion in our Honduras origin, I also notice banana and tropical fruit notes. Okay, now we are moving on to our love. And before you pop this one in your mouth, I just encourage you to stop and smell it. Uh, what does it remind you of? Our, we've heard it, everything from our customers from Christmas to chai spice, pumpkin spice, Mexican hot chocolate. Um, this, it's the first of our three products that are flavored with all natural herbs and spices. And this one's our most complex. It has cinnamon, nutmeg, clove, cardamom, vanilla in it. So all these warming spices. And it's the same beans that we use for our harmony, but I find that the spices end up drawing out a little bit more of the fruity characteristics of the cacao in addition to having that dark chocolatey flavor. Moving on to strength. If you are a spice lover, you're going to have fun with this one. And if you are not, go ahead and pass this along to a spice loving friend or family member. It is our only flavor from our Indonesian origin, and it's a favorite amongst chefs and chocolate makers for the balance of its complexity. It's got lightly sweet, fruity, spicy, salty, smoky, savory notes from the harissa seasoning that we use and all on top of this wonderful cacao. As you chew, you're going to notice a difference between in the texture and the flavor. The texture I find to be a little bit more dense than our Honduras cacao, and the flavor has more fruit notes. Um, cherry and raisin are the ones that I taste most often, and then those get drawn out by the orange essence that we use to finish strength. Finally, we end with joy, and in the spirit of full disclosure, this is also because nobody likes drinking their orange juice after brushing their teeth. So we do strength with orange first and then finish with the mint and joy. And as I was developing this flavor, I find a lot of chocolate mints to be overly sweet. So I wanted to use an all natural, less sweet, very bold mint with rosemary in order to give the cocoa an almost savory characteristic. So this, the herbs in this one make it really great for pairing. You'll find tons of ideas for pairing it with cheese, charcuterie on our recipes and 
pairings page. And if you want to go more sweet with your mint, then it's really great on vanilla ice cream as well. Now that you've had a chance to taste all five flavors and hopefully find a favorite, grab that. And we want to share a minute or two more about what makes our cacao beans so special. First of all, they are peeled, which is very unusual for cacao beans. Chocolate isn't allowed to include cacao shells, and we don't think snacking cacao should either. Uh, additionally, if you want to know why our flavor in the snacking cacao is so much smoother than traditional cacao nibs, we have a separate video on that. Check it out. I'll put the link in the profile. Second, we just want you to know these are all ethically traded with farmer co-ops, both in Indonesia and in Honduras. Additionally, our Honduras uh, partners are both USDA organic and fair trade certified. Finally, snacking cacao empowers farming communities. Most cacao is exported immediately after it's fermented and dried, which means the more profitable value added steps of making it into a food that we can enjoy get exported with it. And this means less income for growers. And it also means they typically don't even get to taste the fruits of their labor. At Good King, it's important to us that we make the food where it's grown, which is why we partner directly with farming communities. The bonus of working the way we do is traditionally men do farming activities and women do the cooking. So by doing additional value added steps in the communities, it means both genders earn a fair wage. Congratulations on completing your first snacking cacao tasting flight. If you are interested in exploring even more of the flavors that cacao has to offer, head over to our recipes and pairings page where we've got everything from breakfast bowls to cheese pairings, salads, and of course, dessert. Uh, most of these ideas came from our customers. So if you find something that you enjoy, please send it our way. We would love to share it with everyone else. Have fun with the rest of your sampler pack and thanks so much for joining me for this tasting.